So, a few months ago, I decided to do a gameplay video of Dragon's Legends The Nine Realms. Not by choice, I was kind of forced into it. Thanks, Fenton. And at the end of that video, I decided to, you know, wrap everything up by playing a Dragon's game that I thought was a little more interesting, which happened to be Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, just with How to Train Your Dragon mods. Even though it almost crashed my computer multiple times, I thought, hey, why not? Let's do it again. Let's actually dedicate a whole playthrough to it. I'm gonna try to get one mission completed. I don't know if I'm going to be able to because I've never played this game on PC in my life. But you're along for the ride now, so let's see what happens. And it crashed already. That's nice. I am just trying to get a feel for the controls and already it's- <laughs> this is epic. He's like karate chopping. He's not even punching. Look who decided to make an appearance. That was rude. Excuse me? Okay, let's try to actually accomplish something for once. This is way more difficult than I remember it being. I was just kind of goofing off last time. I've only ever played San Andreas on the PS2 when I was six years old. Damn, he is hauling it up that hill. We need to stay in charge of our fitness, everyone. It's very important, especially nowadays. This video is sponsored by Future. As a service member in the United States Army, I know a thing or two about how challenging it can be to stay fit, especially when you're built with the bone density of a toothpick like me. Future is a fitness app that pairs you with your own highly credentialed personal trainer who will build you custom workouts you can complete anywhere at any time. Upon signing up, you'll have a video call with your own personal trainer who will design a fitness plan that's unique to you. Future's trainers are equipment agnostic, meaning if you're only able to do bodyweight workouts at home or if you choose to go to the gym, the coach will build it into your plan. Between voice prompts, video check-in calls with your trainer, and messaging within the app, you'll feel like your trainer is always by your side. And if you start to get bored with your plan, your coach will be there to change it and keep you on track with your fitness goals. No matter your level, your trainer meets you where you're at. Whether your goal is to get back to the gym, lose weight, or just be your best self, there's an expert future trainer who knows exactly how to help you. And using my link, tryfuture.co slash audreygraywins, you'll get your first month with your future trainer for the special price of $19. That link is going to be in the description down below, or scan the QR code on your screen right now and see what Future can do for you. And thank you to Future for sponsoring today's video. Grove Street, home. At least it was before I fucked every dang up. I really hope we're over thank a minute into the video time, so I don't get demonetized for that, but I appreciate it. <laughs> okay, I was really looking forward to the cutscene actually working, but it didn't, so I have to skip ahead to the mission. The skin didn't show. I apologize. I am not technically inclined whatsoever. Oh, Drive-by! <laughs> but hey, hiccups in a drive-by now. That's pretty awesome. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, I'm going the wrong- Oops. Oh, no. Oh, shh! <gasps> I got bigger problems than being too far away. I'm kind of getting shot in the face. I can't even see what's happening. Okay, okay. Why are these controls inverted? It's so hard to do anything. Where is everyone? Abolish cars onto us. Split up. Yo, you're just now noticing Keep that. That's nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are they still following us? I'm gonna take that as a yes. I got a whole lot going on. I'm tired. I'll catch y'all later. That basically summed up all of third movie hiccup. Um, can I, uh, just take that? Oh, no, I'll give it back, I promise. Okay, now let's go fuck with stuff. Oh, man. That was that. not a smart move. <clears throat> They'll never see me. <laughs> okay, I think, I think we're doing good. What happens if we go down here? <laughs> this car is fucked. That's the ocean! Out, 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 please. Oh, please. Oh, how is he gonna swim? He only has one leg. Well, contrary to popular opinion, Hiccup is not, not much, much of a swimmer. swimmer. I don't know, he seems to be doing fine to me. Oh, what a lovely evening. So far, we've accomplished a mission, run from the police, stolen a car, and now I'm beaching a boat. I prune that basketball player's private parts. There we go. Why are you walking in the middle of the road? That's so rude. 
Okay, he stopped at the crosswalk. You get to live. <clears throat> I'll be taking this now. Thank you. <laughs> the bus driver just got out! <laughs> okay, step one, get a bus. Step two, think of step two. I don't have one. You know, when people say that the hidden world was lacking in story and character and interesting things happening, I just imagine it being more like this. I feel like it would have been, you know, more well-received. Audrey Greywinds, giving you guys the content you deserve. I don't even know where I am. This is pure hiccup fashion to just get lost, you know, no map, no plan, just fly off into the sunset. I would say that he doesn't normally go on to commit mass homicides, but Race to the Edge exists, so I kind of can't sit- Oh no! Okay, we're finally back at Grove Street. That definitely did not take me 20 minutes off screen that you did not see. Okay, so we all know that I have Hiccup, but what you did not know is that this mod also included another character of the Dragons franchise, and that is Two Slips. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, look at this badass. So I thought we would try to complete a mission as Toothless. This is definitely not going to break the game at all. Can I even get up the stairs? <laughs> he just walks inside. Am I sure I want to save? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I want this on my computer, but sure. I don't know. I don't know. Um. Hello? Hey, I thought I explained some shit. Sweet. Hey, what's up? Since you've been away, shit has changed around here. Grove Street families ain't big no more. Seville Boulevard families and Temple Drive families- What is happening? Show me how they drive on the East Coast, homie. Oh, let's- yeah, I'll show you something. Um. <laughs> hey, oh, Reese still run the barbershop? Like a raggedy ass motherfucker. He popped his membrane years ago. The way I left that old fool in my head. Yeah, oh, right. Whatever. You got five minutes? <laughs> I'll be cutting you like a <laughs> So when you running off again? Oh no, I can't even see where- <laughs> My family, the homies is here. <laughs> we were always here, fool. Yeah. You yeah. still <laughs> busted at me. Yeah, okay, thanks, homie. Yeah, don't mention it. <laughs> this cinematic view is perfect. Alright, let's make it to this place wherever we're going. I don't know because I can't- <laughs> oh right um we're here oh yeah we're getting our hair cut that's what we're doing <laughs> um um <laughs> I, I think i messed it up uh, oops oh, oh. when you accidentally steal a bike get off the bike toothless I can't get into the shop because the car's in the way. That could not have ended more disastrously. <laughs> yeah, I'd be running too. I don't blame them. I can't even see what's going on. Oh, it didn't work. I was really hoping we'd be able to see Toothless get his hair cut, but I guess not. Okay, for reference, I'm recording this video during the daytime for once. And to keep the light from coming in, I have a blanket hung up over my window that's behind my desk. And this is what the blanket looks like. So that is my permanent backdrop while this is happening. Shit. I told you he was crazy. And you jacked up. You're telling me. All right, let's go get pizza. Everyone knows dragons love pizza. <laughs> Look at him run. All right. All right. It, pardon me, everyone. Please don't. What do you want? Do you have fish? <laughs> I can't get over how fucking stupid this looks. Give up the money. This a raid. You can't even see what's happening because the wing's in the way. Oh shit, run! <laughs> oh no! There's no pushover. Let's escape in cinematic view. Take us back to the grove, motherfucker. Woo! Let's get out of here. We didn't need that. Oh, shh. I almost ran into a cop. That would have been bad. You people act like you've never seen this before. Is something the matter? Oh, shh. Some of these cinematic angles scare me. <laughs> yep, this is right. 
Oh! Damn. There is no reason for me to be doing cinematic angle except for the fact that I think it's funny. So I really hope you guys appreciate it because that was not easy. Ryder, my face is like over here. Also, very appropriate that his name is Ryder. Dragon Ryder. <laughs> Let's do another mission as Toothless. This is fun. You want to drive? Yeah, the show. Why do they keep putting me in charge of driving? Do I look like the pinnacle of road safety? <sighs> Let's go. Appreciate that. Thanks. Can I just shoot a plasma blast at it? <laughs> I can't tell where I'm facing. Okay, the, the angles are not helping. I'm just like zooming in on his crotch. His running animation is so funny. I really hope this is working because I can't see. This did not turn out well. Uh, 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 get on the bike, get on the bike, get on the bike. I got busted so hard it broke my game. We're going to try this mission as Hiccup because I cannot accomplish it as Toothless. These rain graphics are just... Oh, ease up, little man. Come on. It's been now we're back to where we left off where I may have gotten arrested. Hello, gentlemen. What a wonderful afternoon. Get fucked! It's like his zipple back ass! Oh my god, this is perfect! That is his fault. <laughs> just fell over dead. Give me that. Well, once again, I have fucked up the mission, so we are just going to try and escape. Okay, we know Hiccup is reckless and often gets himself in danger, but this is a whole new level, even for him. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh! <gasps> no, 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 no! Get away! God damn it. Guys, I cannot pass this mission to save my life. Okay, I have a surprise. I didn't want to end this video off on a dull note failing the mission twice. So, as Toothless, we are going to do what dragons do best, and we are going to take the fuck off and crash again. Take the fuck off! Oh, I don't know how to control it! <laughs> I don't know how to control it. Let's let's do this again. This is like test drive in movie one. Yes. 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 Yeah. Let's go. <gasps> I'm so bad at it, but it looks so badass. Ooh, this is gonna be majestic as fuck. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Ooh. Oh my god, romantic flight. Let's go. Can I do cinematic mode? Yes. <laughs> yes. This is the perfect send off for the video. Hi, Jody. Hey. Oh no, he's crashing. That's not good. Oh no. Oh, oh no. I I'm literally not even touching the keyboard. <laughs> Where is he going? Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. I agree. Oh no, run, run away, run. Jody, do you have anything you'd like to say? Apparently not. You guys are so loud. Am I in the airport right now? Please tell me the forklift is going to work. Please. Please. Oh, I think it's going to. And we're on a runway! Oh my god, yes! What? I literally cannot control it. It's impossible. Yes, here we go! Oh my god! This looks just like the movie! Ooh. Oh my gosh. How to Train Your Dragon 4, DreamWorks, hire me. Look at this, this is beautiful as hell. Ooh, we doing flips. Hell yeah, barrel roll. This is cinematic as shit, hell yeah. Oh my God, this is what I signed up for. Someone play the music over this. This is just like the movie. Oh shit, maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's go. I wish I knew how to control it. That would be probably a little bit helpful. Ooh, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, look, this is like that scene from Dragons 2. We're gonna crash. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 
Oh no. Oh! I am not supposed to be here, apparently. Um. Well, I can't really stop at this point! <laughs> I was not expecting this to go this way. I really was not. I was just trying to fly a forklift. Um. Okay, the, the tree shots are not helping. Oh no. <gasps> Something's about to happen, y'all. A majestic send-off. You know what, I think this is like a, a pretty good place to end it. I don't remember this scene from the movie. I'm gonna be honest. I can't even get out. I think I broke the game. Ooh. All right, I drowned, I guess. <laughs> and that is going to be all for this video. Thank you very much for watching. I don't know what the hell happened. I imagine the edit is going to look pretty wild. I have a big video project coming up in February. It is dragons related, so I think you guys will really like it. This was just supposed to be a fun interlude for a January video. Please consider subscribing if you have not already and consider supporting me on Patreon. This month I reacted to my season one review of Dragons the Nine Realms for its one year anniversary. Wow, I feel old. <laughs> Thank you to Future once again for sponsoring this video, and I will see you guys next month. <laughs> you know what? Still looks better than the Nine Realms.